All right, guys, here with Sierra from The Summit Advocates. Sierra, thanks for joining us today. Good to see you. Thank you. Thanks for having me. Well, of course, this is cool. You guys are doing some really, really cool work. I want to get right into it. Tell me about the program. It's really not program. It's really programs. Yes. Yeah, so what we are doing right now is a healthcare intervention program for pharmacies and various clinics across Summit County. Right. What it does is it provides resources and empowerment to those facilities to intervene in situations of domestic violence. Um, we provide information about the signs of abuse, how to respond to someone showing those signs, how to respond to someone uh, who has disclosed abuse um, or has used the code word mask 19. Um, right. and how to, yeah, exactly. And how to respond yeah. to that depending on their um, policies. So this could be, I'm just making this example up, this could be somebody walks into a local pharmacy, right, and says, mm -hmm. hey, mask 19, to the, literally to the pharmacist, and through this program you guys are doing, that pharmacist, he or she would know, hey, there's something going on here, and here's what I do. Exactly. So I provide a guidelines packet for all of these providers, which okay. goes over different ways that you can respond to that code word depending on what is your level of comfortability, your safety, and right. your policies? Right, totally. And I know that when you and I talked a few days ago, Sierra, it, it was kind of, you pointed out something so cool is that with this lockdown we're under, and it's starting to ease up a little bit, but it's still a lockdown, a lot of people aren't really going out. They're not going to restaurants, they're not going places, but they do go to the pharmacy to pick up essential medicines. That's why it's such a hub for this communication. Exactly. And even before this pandemic, um, victims of domestic violence are isolated fr um, from their community members a lot of the time. So that is especially going on now during this pandemic and these stay-at-home orders and why it is even more essential than it already had been for healthcare providers to know information on domestic violence and how they can make a difference in people's lives. And huge. And it's just it's just opening up that communication. So if somebody has a problem, there, there's a route, there's a way forward. And before we let you go, we got about 30 seconds left here. You're also encouraging other healthcare providers to get involved. So maybe I'm a pharmacy somewhere else in BRAC or wherever. Hey, I can get on board with the program. Absolutely. Yeah. If any pharmacy or healthcare provider that ha we have not been able to reach out to yet would like to know more, they can visit our website, Summit Advocates, and reach out to us at info at summitadvocates.org as well. Okay, that sounds great. And uh, I mean, just a huge program doing a world of good. Really, thanks so much for all that you do, uh, do for the county. And um, uh, we'll put the website down at the bottom again, Sierra. Um, and, uh, and again, if somebody has questions, they can just hit you up or call you, right? Absolutely. Thanks so much for having me today. We'll see you again soon with an update on things. Keep up the good work. Thank you so much.